Oh yeah. Are you alright? Morena, oder guten Morgen. We are in Germany today, so you probably just saw a quick montage of us getting here last night. I decided not to film too much because, to be honest, traveling is tedious while you're doing it, let alone having to watch it again on camera. So we um, had a relatively average sleep last night. We are like in a relatively cheap hostel like we usually do, but we're right by the sun, so it was like super bright in our room. So we've got to pick up some like eye masks today. Right now we're about to head towards the Berlin Hauptbahnhof to, uh, we're gonna arrange some tickets, I think, to go to Rostock tomorrow. We're gonna be in Berlin today and Sunday. Today's Friday. Um, and then I think for the rest of the day we're going to try to do our own mini walking tour. Uh, there's a Brandensburg Gate that Brendan wants to see and I really want to see the um, East Side Berlin uh, wall memorial thing because it's where all the kind of graffiti art and that is. So yeah, super exciting day ahead of us. I'm sure it will be good. Um, we also need to get a bit of a snack, I feel, on our way. Oh my god, we went to this vegan Vietnamese place for dinner last night. We luckily booked because otherwise I think they probably would have closed early because it was pretty quiet. Oh my god, the best bloody Asian food I've had since going pretty vegan. So yeah, I was really excited by that. That was awesome. Anyway, join us on our walk today. Such an awesome building. At night, all these uh, like panels light up and it looks really cool. So Christmassy, the happy tiger bear is like, I've got the bellies of the animals. Boop -a -doop. That's so cool. And pretzel, hi cheese. Mm. Um, nom, nom. I need a little right here, I think. That's hop on half. It's slightly better view. So good. I must admit though, it did take us quite a while to figure out where we could buy tickets from. It was like a bit of a like, chase and sign type thing. But luckily there was a lovely man at information who pointed us in the right direction. Thanks, I'm super excited because it's a Christmas tree! Christmas tree! Jared said how to do Christmas. We're gonna go up there tonight. And there's a needle pointy thing. Pointy thing. Bubble, bubble, bubble. My bubble. Oh, look how sweet we're being. Holding hands, pulling the fingers, walking on cobbled streets. Fat Poppy. Where's your owner, Fat Poppy? Fat Poppy is fat. He does, but he's still fat. Naked man, his penis is gone, someone snapped off his penis. Oh, his poor penis. And that is the Brandenburg Gate, we made it. Not too much more. And there's also a giant Christmas tree, which makes me super happy. The green men look really funny here. Found some lions in the forest in Berlin. Oh, it's got an arrow in it, and it's really sad. Oh, poor mummy lion. Who did that to you? Victory Colin! Horses with a Christmas tree background. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. It's funny because you can't really see the bubbles. The memorial was quite well done, but there wasn't much information around there, so we might have to go googling that later just to see what inspired it. But it was just basically a whole lot of um, columns about this human grave site, different sizes. In the middle, you could they were like towering over you and around the edges, they were kind of you know at shin level. So it was it was um, yeah, it was interesting. So I think now we're gonna go settle and grab some coffee because even in gloves, my hands are freezing. Uh, and then we can find out more about what we're going to do next. I think after coffee we might head to Checkpoint Charlie and then head, head across the East Wall Memorial. Um, it's, at least it's a really nice day. 
but it's just cold. It's cold and tomorrow is going to be even colder. Yay! Or at least, you know, maybe if it snowed. I think I'd be happier if it snowed. Because then at least I could be like, yay, it's snow! I say this now and then it snows, so I'll probably be like, oh my god, it's freezing. But, you know, what is? Good place for a casual midday drink, as you do. The man from the traffic light, and there's a whole cafe for him. The shop. But there's a cafe as well, look. The different types of men on the traffic lights. They have temple men gummy bears. Germany, I'm so confused. Why is there a shop designated to the traffic light man? <laughs> I swear Turn the corner and you see this. Pretty cool. I think like a big random thing over here. Let's go check that out and not get run over. Hope. For those who hope in a giant pile of trash. Interesting. Yeah. Horses. They're so cute. Fingers crossed there's good coffee here. You know the coffee shop's good when they can actually make a pattern with oat milk. <laughs> coffee was a success and the soup was delicious. Feeling a little bit warmer now. So we're gonna go head more towards the East Side Gallery. I think we're gonna try and stop at a donut place on the way, which should be exciting. And yeah, it's already starting to like feel like it's gonna get darker soon. Hopefully not for another couple of hours. There's currently like hail or small hail dropping from the sky, but we don't know what the term is because we don't know snow terms. I don't think it's snow though, because it's, it's too, ha too hard. But it's pretty exciting, but it's also cold. All these emotions at once. Oh, random pipes. Random pipes covered in graffiti pipes. Let's walk along the river. River walks in Berlin, yeah! Canal walks in Berlin, yeah! <laughs> Look at it! Look at the snail. Just looks like a white blob. It's not a snail. It is a snail. It's my snail. I don't know if I should take this personally or not. Sadly, they don't like us. This place is really cool. Mm. I love all the colours. They're like, someone gave me food. Oh, look. This lovely woman up here is throwing the food. I mean, they probably shouldn't be getting bread, but it's a thought that counts, right? Swans don't just get bread. They get cakes. Hello, swans. Big and donuts, big and donuts. And a pumpkin spice latte. Can't go through a winter without one. Made by bees and sweet people. They're so happy. They're so happy. Idiot. As it's a gorgeous cloud. So cool. The bonnets. There's all the bonnets. Someone likes the bonnets. So cool. I've always wanted to come see the Berlin Wall and what they've done to it. It's just ah, oh, really cool. Like public art gallery, I suppose. Mum and Dad totally need to come here. Dad would love this. Uh, 
that was awesome I always always wanted to see that ever since learning about it as a kid um, no it was really really well done maybe more to go but I just better reflect on it now it is really cold and the sun is starting to go down so we may head for another indoor bit soon but oh my goodness it's been absolutely amazing giant ball <laughs> we found a Christmas market yay <laughs> Happy Brandon. <laughs> it's so exciting. I love all the Christmas stuff. So exciting. Oh my god, it's two storied. Yeah. You have the top all the bottom. Oh, I think it's like snowing or sleeting or something. But it's cold, but it's cool. I wonder if you can see it. Can you kind of see it? Look at it, it's exciting. It's like snowing. Oh my God, this is so exciting. It's snowing. <laughs> Craft beer and coffee. Oh, time to hide from the weather and get a beer and also my battery's flashing so I can change my new one. Brendan. Hello, mommy. Yum. The dinner was so, so good. We didn't book, but she managed to squeeze us in. Now we're off to the Ragtag building to see up in the dome, which will be exciting. And then hopefully we're gonna hit one of the better Christmas markets. Well, one of the like old school Christmas markets, which should be cool before we head back. We will see where we end up. But I'm excited about all the lights. In fact, we're in Germany and it's exciting. We're at the top of the dome! The Reichstag concept, well, Reichstag place, parliamentary building. It's awesome, it's such a cool building. And the views are gorgeous, even though it's like pissing with rain outside. But it's fine. And all that's mirrors. Mirror, mirror, mirror. I'll show you from the bottom. Now you can see the mirrors. Turn down. And then up where we walked pretty exciting. Such a cool building. Set past the awesome Christmas tree. <laughs> Light forest. that was so much fun it was so good to be back at a German Christmas market you could definitely tell this Christmas market was a bit more upper class but the glue vine was amazing and there was opera singers I mean what more could you ask for I'm gonna head back it's gonna be like another 45 minute walk home but you know we just love walking around cities um, so I will catch you tomorrow morning probably on our way to the train station to go to Rostock which is going to be super exciting. Yeah we came into the Ampleman shop and apparently David, David Hasselhoff has as well. You know, famous places in Berlin. <laughs> the Dome! The Dome! So today has looked like a whirlwind, but here is an idea of what we've actually done. I'm really tired right now. I'm gonna head to bed, but I just thought you should not. Oh, Morena! It's nice and early, 7.30 in the morning. We are just heading to the Hoffmannhof to get the train, to go to Rostock, once we had a bit of food, and oh my god, it's snowing and it's so exciting! I'm like slightly tired from <laughs> lots of walking yesterday, um, but the snow is just cheering me up. Like, it's exciting. <laughs> right, I will catch you after our long train journey. Two story. story. We made it to Rostock, and oh my goodness, so many people were going from Rostock. Like, sorry, to Rostock. I was not expecting this. Brennan had me believe it was this tiny little town, which it probably still is, but apparently it's the place to come this weekend. So we'll see what's happening here. Uh, we're gonna go for a little stroll around. Brendan did a little short stint at uni here. 
Um, so he's gonna show me kind of what he did, where he went, before we hit to the Christmas markets later. So that should be exciting. We're in the university. Brendan's old home. Where actual work happened. So quiet because it's the weekend. It's so weird being around a university campus and no one around. You're kind of like do -do 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 -do. down our little street. Oh, they're so cute. I want to hug one. We made it to civilization and the club that Brendan used to party at. Oons, oons, oons. That was a fun little tour around the university sort of area. It's quite interesting seeing where Brenda went. It's really hard to imagine though when there's like no people around. She's like, it's so cold and like three big blobs of buildings. We're now gonna go and get a coffee and I think I might have a look at a map and just kind of see where we walked because it kind of doesn't make sense for you just wandering around sometimes. It's quite cool this part of town. Wow, it really is a city. <laughs> We just found like a vegan bakery place and there was like a nougat ring type thing which tasted like a ring of tall water and that was vegan and it was delicious and I'm really happy right now. Two sanders in one place, how does that happen? Dun dun dun. I swear I Time to get lunch I think, cause I'm hungry. Doo -doo -doo. We saw a really cool place. So that food was amazing. I am so full, but oh my goodness, those burgers were so good. Yep, yep, I'm gonna say so good a lot. I know, I shouldn't. Anyway, I think we're gonna go ahead and see the Rostock Cathedral because it's one thing that Brendan always wanted to do but never got round to. And then on to the Christmas market and see where we get to. The weather is not looking too bad, so hopefully we don't get rained in. I would really love for it to snow again though, because that was lots of fun. Cool donation gets you in there, but it was pretty cool. Um, we, oh gosh, I can't believe how busy it is at the Christmas market. Just wondering whether or not we find a pub and just sit down for a bit and like wait for it to wean down a bit and have a rock knocker. What do you think? Maybe? So we had a quick little beer just to kind of get away from the madness and now we're back into it and it's dark, which is exciting. Wow. It's angry oh snow! Oh my god! So we're just heading back to the train station now. It's been a super crazy uh, evening, which is why I haven't filmed much. But, oh my God, so much fun, so much glue vine, so much happiness. Managed to find a corn on a cob, which was delicious, can I just say. So I'll probably catch you when we're back in Berlin tomorrow morning, unless I see anything exciting along the way. See you then. Morena, it's our last day in Berlin today. We just checked out the, the hotel hostel thingy and just gonna head to the train station, put our bags in the lockers, hopefully, and then go and explore for our last day. We don't fly out to like 9.30 tonight, so we've got like a proper full day, which is awesome. Um, yeah, did lose one of my gloves last night because we kind of got hungry when we got home and went to McDonald's and I kind of had to take my glove off to eat the chips and then I lost it. So hopefully that will be found somewhere otherwise we'll need new gloves because it's another chilly one, no snow this morning though sadly. Bags are away and we had just ticket ticketed, just purchased an all day uh, train ticket and we're gonna go do a little bit of Christmas market exploring. First off we're gonna go to the Charlottenburg Schloss palace um there's apparently a market around there and also the area is quite cool and then if we get time we might try and check out check out check out the uh eco christmas market in kind of more central berlin and then yeah we'll see where we get to but yeah oh so good to have the bristol in the belly mm. so cool Unnecessarily loud bells. 
it's the Charlottenburg Schloss or Palace and Marco's there so hopefully it's open. There's also a museum around here as well which apparently also does a cool old Christmas market with all local handmade stuff. So we will see what we find. It is bloody freezing though. Oh my goodness. That was such a cool setup for that Christmas market. Um, it's very, very cold there though. So now we're going to check out the little local one and then head back to the train station to head back into town. This part of the Christmas market, well this little Christmas market was very very cool because yeah there were so many more local businesses you could tell which is kind of nice because you didn't get the kind of same mass produced stuff that you're getting in most of the Christmas markets which isn't to say it's not fun walking around them but it's just nice to actually celebrate local people and their work. So pretty. Oh, I know you're probably sick of me saying this, but oh my goodness, that was so delicious. It was so delicious. A nice hot soupy noodly thing on a freezing cold day. So the sun started to go down now. We're gonna head to the train station soon, but we thought we've got like another couple of hours to spare, so we thought we would head into one of the bigger, kind of more commercial Christmas markets, which is about a 10-minute walk away. Just wander around there for a bit and then pick up our bags from the Berlin Hauptbahnhof and then head to the airport. Take rails, but it's been a really awesome time so far. All of the lights, all of the lights. Christmas market. We've now come to the Alexander Park Christmas market again just to have one more blue vine before we jump on the train, head on the plane and fly back to the UK. So I'll probably leave you here. I hope you enjoyed this little snippet into our three day adventure. Um, if you did, give me a thumbs up to let you know and subscribe if you want to see more random things. Otherwise, I'll catch you later. Bye guys. Bye. So exciting.